And that's where I think, I think oral minoxidil comes in as a, more of a sure bet as opposed to topical. And when it comes to finasteride topical, I think that's warranted as a secondary option only if the, the side effects from going systemic with oral medication is just too much to bear. Right. Um, and that's the whole reason why we have topical to begin with. It's not because it's any better than oral. There's anything out there that's, that's saying that's the case is heavily skewed in favor of the manufacturer that commissioned that study. Um, and, you know, and, and, and that's why it's there. I mean, I, I was there for the formulation of one of the first ones available before HIMS, before Keeps, and that was the whole reason. It was recognized that there's a market for something that could be effective, not expected to be as effective, but, but with the trade-off is less likely of uh, uh, incident of side effects. That's the and whole point of the market. Yeah, and it's important to note, just for listeners, um, and also, obviously, you know, neither of us are doctors, so speak to your doctor for anything.